Hey everyone, I'm Gunther from Falco, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Falco Cloud IDE to develop Qt Quick applications directly in your browser. You can start off your development with one of the Falco app demos. There are many cool demos that you can take a look at from, with different kinds of features, for example, um, with uh, maps involved, with uh, a news feed like you're having a, in a social network app. Um, or also yeah, Spotify, Spotify like music streaming app. So I will just use this template for now. And I call it my music player and create the project. Project was successfully created. Um, I can now again jump into the web IDE. And here we have it. So this is yeah, basically a user interface prototype for an application uh, for listening to music like you would know from Spotify. You can also select to shuffle play, which uh, gives me a big view like this. You can also favorite the song, and it will show up in the favorited library then. And yeah, let's say we want to make an improvement to this project, um, for example, to yeah, give the, the favoriting feature a little bit of a better look. Um, I open up the components in my project tree, and I can see the actual playing model, which is this one, which is open right here. I can hit Command F to enter the search. Favorite, and let's see, OK, here's an icon button, which um, is for the, used for favoriting the song. So that's what we want. And here we have the color. Um, let's change it when it's a favorite not use the theme text color, but I'll show it in a light green color, let's say. Hit save. And you can already see, now we have a cool light green color for favoriting this. Um, I can also do some cooler changes. Um, for example, I can add a new property, state whether it is current request. And on the press or release uh, on the button, and setting the state of this component. And then let's just scale it up a little when it is pressed. So a little bigger when it's in press state. And I can also add a quick animation to make it look even cooler. Property animation, duration of 50. Let's see. And we can already see now we have a cool scale animation. When we click the button, it gets bigger and it also changes its color. Let's say that's all we wanted to achieve. We can decide to commit these changes. We have an overview now of what we added. So I added the change for the green color. And I also added this animation block here. I paste my commit message. To the repository. If you want to learn more, please check out the full webinar linked below.